Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is a barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of their excitement and expectation. This place simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. You're just joining us, we are already on the way. Straight through to the keeper. Check. Jacarini. He's through now, is he in? Great strength, too strong for his opponent. A few interesting forays forward, but so far they haven't amounted to much. Check, hoists it forward. Well, the fact that we haven't had an attempt on goal is becoming a, an embarrassing reflection on these teams. He gets past his man. And he's there to hoof it away. Fence has got rid of that. Going through. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be out-muscled. Looks to clip it forward. Good running with the ball, can they build on it? Timely intervention. No messing about, just bludgeoned away. And the counter is on. It's got through to him. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Great run this, he's covered quite a distance. Another chance from a corner. They've played it short. Oh, that's nice. He's had a shot! And it's a goal! First blood drawn. Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. I just thought that was going to hit the outside of the post for a moment there, but it just curled enough to catch the inside for a very good strike.
Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Hardly anything between the sides, and it's 1-0. Forward it goes. Coming up to half-time, leading, and things are looking pretty good. He's got the ball, he's got the spade, he's had a goal! No mistake! Hot knife through butter, they have done it again! Uh, given such an open invitation, he was always going to shoot. Well, it's pretty damning on the part of that defence, Peter, that he was allowed so much time and space. But I think you have to give credit where it's due. And it was a brilliant set-up and finish. Things starting to look very comfortable. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt will be... Oh, that looks a foul. Yeah, referee's given it. And he's going to have his name taken. Well, sometimes a loose foul can trigger a completely different spell of play, and uh, it makes even less sense. to a promising move. And it's Ciaccarini. Good run down the left. What can they make of it? Shoots! Big relief. It just needed better contact. Oh, no, that was a chance. What a chance. A heavy challenge. And they're not going to make any further progress now. Tries lifting it over. And it's half-time here. What do you think we're up to after 45 minutes? Well, they had their opponents reeling in that half, Peter, and the break may need to change somehow, but don't hold me to it. Of massive entertainment and excitement, a two goal margin, yes, but all things still possible. Whistle goes, and we start the second half. Giacarini, and he has been fouled there. Ciaccarini. Yeah, it looks like a, a change of approach, and it may just freshen things up.
cuts it out. Yeah, that's top defending in preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Tries to get it forward quickly. Should have done better, and he knows it. That's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. And it's Ciaccarini. Now, can he capitalise? That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. He's played him through. it upfield the referee's awarded a free kick he came in hard very hard Nothing wrong with that tackle. Ball won cleanly. He's got away. Has a hit! They are rampant! And they are cruising away. No space, no problem. You just cannot stop him. Oh, this fella's as slippery as a needle the way he freed himself to score. I mean, for that defence, it was a case of, oh, you've got him, no, you don't. Brilliant. <laughs> Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Play for a throw. He's there to receive it. He's through. This has gone, that's a uh, foul. And no surprise, that's a booking. So here comes the substitution. substitution. Number 23. Number 23. He 
keeper's got good distance on that. Well, it seems obvious that the plan is to, to try and get their passing game going again, but not with that lack of quality. He's through the middle. Ahead by three, but they won't want to take their foot off the pedal. Made sure that that won't get through. Check. Shakarini. Time and again, they are repelled. they perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front they really commit forward in numbers too it was all very well drilled So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Things looking so easy, almost too easy here. And it's got through. Gets into some space. It's a throw in. Whistle's gone, and they've got themselves a free kick. Has a pop! In it goes! The lightness of step, the sharpness of movement, the certainty of finish. Well, they have a goal, but it is surely too much to hope for a comeback. Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. And a great day for attacking football. The artists have painted their pretty pictures. Only one team in it. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Well, they approach this with a very definite game plan, and I think to a large extent they remain true to that, and we can give the manager a, a big pat on the back. And all that remains for me is to thank Jim Beglin. That's it from us tonight. A very good evening to one and all.